Hey guys, welcome back to more My Hero Academia reaction. So before we get started, just a quick disclaimer. We are both sick. Mm -hmm. uh, we have cough drops and water and tea on standby. So just if there's any interruptions, you know, please. Or if we sound weird. Yeah. If we, we apologize weird, yeah, in advance. Just, yeah, we're, we're sick. Mm -hmm. It's that time of year, you know, cough and cold, cough, cold and flu season. So anyways, back to my hero. I remember it's like kind of like the aftermath of All Might versus All For One. The teachers, mm -hmm. Aizawa and All and All Might are making their rounds, trying to round up students, get permission from their parents to have them stay at the Door. dorms. Which is actually like I I think it's a pretty good idea. You know, considering they'll be on campus, they'll be safer, pro heroes to watch them, extra security, all be in one place. But it could also mean that they're also a, a walking target as well. So there's that. Um, I also remember like All Might apologizing and begging Deku's mom too like for you know doing what he did without his without her permission you know giving his quirk to um, her, her son without her knowledge and all that and yeah he made a promise to look after Deku mm -hmm. like for with sure with no powers yeah with no power so it's like yeah I wonder how that's gonna go actually mm -hmm. you know but he promises to watch over him be an actual teacher and mentor to him more so than he was before so anyways with that being said let's get on with this video if you're going to go back to this school you have to be so careful oh yeah that's deku's side too i will make you worry no he can't make her worry he has to be extra cautious you're so not cool. only that but also looking. His condition. Yes. Remember? So my baby. Like his I joints are damaged. How wholeheartedly he respects you makes you. She reminds me of my predecessor. She does. What? Oh, wait, how so? Nana. It's the hairstyle. Oh. oh. Sure. Okay. <laughs> I just got the mighty heart of a hero. Ew! Look at that walking skeleton. Hey, <laughs> hold on. You are gonna get all the. Shut the fuck up, bitch. <laughs> Rude ass people. Right, body shaming all my. Left home. Oh, she does have the same hair as her. Nana Shimura. Damn! Of course. <laughs> He's still on his path to the hair of green. They built a student dorm. Heights Alliance One, eight, constructed in alliance. just three days. Damn. Mine. Three days? No. Our new home. It's like college. Uh-huh. It's also how we're addressing one of the threats we've yet to take care of. The leak. A feeling of unease has settled Ooh. upon our school. So I haven't revealed them all. Suspect not just if it weren't for All Might's retirement from the hero scene, I would expel everyone here, except Bakugo Jiro and Agakure. The five of you who went, of course, but also the remaining twelve who didn't stop them. Oh, oh shit! Trust, even if it was to keep your friends, they're responsible the for each other. In order to regain our confidence, I get it. You'll need to obey every rule. Come here. Uh, uh -huh. Why? What? <laughs> Why? What? Why? What do you do? Kirishima. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! So, this is my money, you idiot, to replace what you spent. Oh no! <laughs> what was that for? <laughs> oh, distraction. Mm. Thanks. Each student dormitory holds one class. Girls are on the right, and boys are on the left. The entire first floor is a common area. I can already see the ball kid, Minetta, Minetta going over to the girl side yeah. a lot. This room is about the same size as my closet at home. Damn, bitch! Closet? I know he could have died, but it's kind of exciting to be living here. <laughs> class. It's the perfect way to increase our cooperation and discipline. Oh my god, I just realized their uniform. It says UA. Oh, yeah. Now. Well, let's go around and see who has the coolest room. <laughs> ah, no way you can't go in there. Please, it's not good for... Oh, oh they're obs... Sorry, yeah, yeah. they're going to see his obsession. Well, I admire him. No way. <laughs> <laughs> 
tight. Oh my god. This is kind of creepy. This is kind of demonic. The last person on this floor is... Minetta. Hey, come on in, girl. Nope. No. No. I would not go in there. That's a trap. Uh, the third floor? Oh, it's so boring. It's so boring. I feel like that would be my room. That's because the boys are the only ones who are getting picked on. They fed it with a contest to see who has Where's the girls' rooms? He just wants an excuse to peep into their room. It's only fair. And that is how the girls are sleeping. This is a filler episode, huh? Uh huh. Oh, Who knows what scintillating secrets I'll find? The thirst is real. I'm over it. I wonder who's thirstier. Um, Mineta or Jiraiya? That's a competition. Next is Todoroki's room. Ooh. The most capable student in our class. So Japanese. I've got these kind of floor mats at my home. So fluffy. I could eat it every day. That shit looks so wrong. It does. The one with the invisible girl? She looks like a dick. It's kind of embarrassing. Damn! Oh, recording it's studio. It's because Jira's totally punk rock. Next is me. Welcome in, guys. Her room is very is pink. girly. Oh my god, bro. Jeez. Sue. I haven't seen her. Oh, she wasn't feeling too good, so she's in her room. Well, we should. What if her room's all swampy well, she and shit? Show us later when she's feeling. Up is Yao Yorozu. It's probably is, some rich I shit. Maybe miscalculated a few things, and maybe not as creative. Oh my oh. god! My bed is huge. Is that a king size bed? It's my furniture from home, so I thought it fit. I had no idea how small these dorm rooms would end up being. I forget. Rich girl problems. Here are the results of the first best room competition. Minus Bakugo and Sue. Drum roll, please. My vote's on uh, either Todoroki or Earjack. Todoroki. Rikido Sato. Oh, the baker. Oh. Why does she look creepy as fuck? I thought I'd stopped you, but it turns out I was worthless. A complete failure. I didn't think I deserved to joke around and have fun with everyone like usual. But. What? That's why I wanted to talk to you. Even if I'm still not sure how I'm supposed to be feeling. I wanted you to know so we could hang out and talk and have a good time again. <laughs> what? It's not just you who thinks that. I think she's just upset because she called them villains. Oh. And, and then the fact that they went and again. did it. It's kind of like come up with. pretty so much like a villain, like what she was saying. And she felt like it created an awkward vibe. You shouldn't feel bad. Uh, Sue, so, so, listen, I won't make you sad again. The <laughs> <laughs> fuck? <laughs> this was a cute little filler. Mm hmm. Um, there was a room competition. Mm hmm. And then that thing with Asui. Yeah. I don't know, I feel like. Once you start dorming with friends, mm. I feel like the first thing I would do is like play video games with them. <laughs> like, yeah. You know? Yeah. Uh, I don't think it would be like room a room competition is like far from I know. what I'd expect. But I guess because there's so many of them. I guess they needed something to do for a whole episode. Yeah, they and need more activity. Playing video games is not enough. It's not. Like going through individual rooms is enough to like kill time yeah and there's 20 of them mm -hmm. i don't know i thought it was all right like the filler i guess it was cute it was cute Mineta's um, thing was like the most entertaining thing uh-huh his thirstiness uh-huh as usual yeah when it comes to like fillers like these his thirstiness kind of carries takes it. over mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i kind of like bakuko's gesture for kirishima oh so that he doesn't owe him. Yeah, but it's also like his way of low-key saying thank you. Why did he pay him again? The binoculars. Why? His binoculars broke? Probably. Oh. 
I didn't see them break. I didn't see them break either, but maybe he lost them. Maybe it broke. Oh. Go figure. But he used what's his face as a distraction. Yeah. Everybody's looking at his dumbness. Poor Kaminari. Right? Then again, he's a comedic relief like Mineta. Mm hmm. They're working on their getting their licenses. Mm-hmm. Next. Next episode, it's gonna, they're going to work on their ultimate move. Mm hmm. I can't wait to see Deku's. Right? It can't be Detroit Smash. It can't be any can't of the Smashes be, that are already taken. It can't be United States of Smash. Maybe he could put in a New York there, actually. You know, but that's just like copying All Might. Uh, true. Because All Might is like, his character is paying homage to, you know, American superheroes. Mm-hmm. You know, because we're pretty much the pioneers of comic books and superheroes yeah we kind of have that monopoly over here yeah like dc and marvel Mm -hmm. that's why all might's moves are named after states and cities Mm -hmm. and america so deku needs to come up with his own shit maybe something japanese i guess (laughs) tokyo smash that kind of seems more like todoroki's thing oh that's true because his room was hella japanese well he can't like tokyo fire Oh, that shit doesn't sound right. It doesn't sound right. Tokyo Smash sounds Tokyo. better. Japan Smash. Yeah, doesn't. It really, doesn't. That shit sounds right. It doesn't whack. ring that easily either. I mean, all my smashes don't really roll off the tongue either, too. They sound fine now because we've been hearing Hang them, them over, over and over. over. But like, once you hear it at first, when we hear it the, for the first time, it's like kind of odd. It is. So anyways, what did you guys think of this episode? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. I'm Ray. I'm Danny. And we'll see you in the next video.